Hey everybody, it's Slime Beast yet again. Plagued Moth is back on YouTube. Hooray! Now everybody can watch him sell gore to anyone who will pay him, even children. You can also watch Moth looking at babies in pain and being tortured while simultaneously claiming that he doesn't look at videos and pictures of children, but that's beside the point. Moth is also right back to lying, harassing, doxing, and doing all of the usual shit that he got smacked for in the first place on his previous Twitter account. That's right, this is a ban evasion Twitter account, where he's just continuing to harass people and lie about shit. I just wanted to address some stuff here because this shows what a fucking idiot Moth is. First of all, he's posting up this thing that was already disproven with the uh, fake account that impersonated me in his chat, probably orchestrated by him himself. I'm going to put the evidence up on screen showing again that this is a fake account because the real account had the option to block it. The fake account had no option to block it because the fake account was deleted. Shows that it's two separate accounts. What a goddamn moron. Plague Moth already knows this. He is still putting this forward anyway because he's a lying piece of shit. What I want to address mostly in this video, though, is these other screen caps, okay? He says that this is me talking to someone on DeviantArt. Wow, that's really awesome, Stephanie. Great work. And it's from somebody named Untitled Anonymous. Now, why does he think that Untitled Anonymous in 2005, why does he think that was me? Because the name Christopher is on the account. I shit you not, that is the only reason he is saying this is me. And he is saying this with 100% certainty, that this was me. There is no other option. He is putting this forward as fact. So let's prove that this dumb motherfucker is a lying piece of shit yet again. Moth, I know you're watching this, you abject coward. Uh, so I just want, I want you to really revel in the fact that you are about to be proven a liar yet again. When we go to the Wayback Machine, we can look up the account that Plagued Moth was talking about, Untitled Anonymous on DeviantArt. So yeah, if he had just bothered to do this, he would have seen immediately that he was wrong. But he also would have continued saying it anyway because he is a lying sack of shit. Uh, so looking it up really wouldn't have changed anything. When we look at Untitled Anonymous's account, we can see that he had a Yahoo Messenger account. And the Yahoo Messenger account's name is Steve. This guy's name is Steve, not Chris. Do you want to know why it said Christopher under his name? It's a reference to Chris Brown. He started out his account with Chris Brown as his subtitle, and eventually his subtitle was changed to Christopher because of Chris Brown. Further, if we go ahead in time to 2007, we can see uh, not only did this guy leave DeviantArt because he said DeviantArt lost its purpose, but we can also find more information here, including a website. Uh, we can find, again, that the guy's name is fucking Steve. Uh, we can find Midlife Crisis as his age. I don't think I was going through a Midlife Crisis in 2007 when I was 27. You goddamn fucking idiot moth. Current residence, Springfield, Missouri. Mmm. Springfield, Missouri. Ouch. Even more proof that this is someone else's fucking account. So yeah, we have thoroughly disproven moth's claims. Uh, Dylan Morgan is a liar. Dylan Morgan is a doxer. Dylan Morgan is a harasser, Dylan Morgan is generally an awful person, and he and his horrible, horrible, horrible wife deserve each other. And the only people who are still in denial are people like this fucking idiot uh, who says, Slimy Boy is fucking obsessed with you. He comments on a post of Moth tweeting about me. So, Moth tweeting about me is me being obsessed with him. You too are a fucking moron. But then again, I guess fucking morons have orbiters who are also fucking morons. And now, an appeal to Plagued Moth's non-existent humanity. Plagued Moth, I know that you are watching this. I know that your horrible, horrible wife is watching this. I know that your stupid fucking fans who enjoy reveling in the murder and torture of children are watching this. Think about the fact that you are proven wrong at every turn. Think about the fact that everything you say is proven to be a lie. Why don't you just fucking give up? Why don't you just fucking admit that you're full of shit? Move on with your life. I mean, 
Moth and all of his little orbiters like to talk about Moth's family. How about you focus on your family and taking care of them instead of focusing on everybody that you hate? Think of all the time you've spent going through files, going through notes, going through comments, trying to find information on the people you hate. That's time you could have been playing with your kids. That's time you could have been earning money to support them. Instead, it seems a lot like when it comes down to it, you will choose me over your family every time.